Hi my funky friends! I'm so excited to hang out with you today. I think it is time for a late summer, hoping for cozy weather, but trying to appreciate the season that is summer, little bookstore outing. <laughs> We're gonna have some cozy reading time together and hang out at my favorite coffee shop, Mickey's, which is um, just a neighborhood staple, and I'm excited to bring you with me. But if you're new here, my name is Asia, and we do a lot of things here, but one thing's for sure, we're always bringing the vibes. So the end of summer is coming and the fall is going to be approaching soon and I just want to like take this moment while I have some free time for myself. Luke unfortunately is working on a lot of projects so he's not able to join me but I just want to like enjoy a day out but still be chill. Um, I feel like doing these little low effort max cozy, max vibey <laughs> outings are like such a great way to break up the like homebody um, routine, but also not in an overstimulating way. So I'm gonna go hang out with Pocky and bring her to my favorite coffee shop slash used bookstore and I'm excited to bring you with me. It's been a little while since Pocky has taken a walk all the way to Mickey's and I think she's remembering how much of a fraidy cat she really is. I love walking over to Mickey's because you just get to like take a moment to enjoy not only the outdoors but just how cute every like neighbor has their front yard set up, their little porch moments. It's so fun. Okay, so the plan is we're gonna go to Mickey's and I just saw a post that they um, just got in a ton more new books. So I think that we should pick out um, books that just like speak to us and I might like do like a quick little Google just to make sure that it's not like a dumb book. <laughs> not that there's any dumb books but you know. Um, but we'll pick out some books and read them there. At least read the first one there. Maybe finish them at, at home. It kind of depends on how quick of reads they are. I'll give you my first thoughts on um, the book set we got from Mickey's. All right, Pocky is in stage three of how she feels while being on a walk. Her first stage is she's super excited. Her second stage is realizing how afraid of everything she is for no reason. And then stage three is she's like, oh yeah, I do like walks. They're so fun. And then she's just a happy little girl.
Yeah, definitely. Also, sorry, I feel lame. I'm like no, 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 doing a vlog. <laughs> <laughs> this is Pocky. So she is. Sweet little Freddy Cat girl. She's so cute. She is. <laughs> Saturdays because I'm always nervous that there's gonna be a lot of people here but I just heard that it's typically not busy after the morning which makes sense so this might be like my new Saturday reading spot
the way through of the unbearable lightness of being and so far it's really good um, i normally would just like finish this all the way through but there's no way i'm gonna get through two entire books um in one sitting at a place that is not my home even though it feels very much like home um so i'm gonna move on to um everything is illuminated but unbearable lightness of being is so good so far i really love the stories where the characters really represent like philosophical ideas. We have a lot of people that project on others. There's a exploration of whether or not it's easier or better or I don't know, more beneficial to numb out and like not think about the consequences, your inevitable consequences that, you know, it gives to others or how your life affects others. Um, or if it's better to like be super mindful and be in the moment, being really super aware of how you affect other people around you. So interesting so far. It's like kind of a romance, but not really. Um, I was drawn to it by this dog on the cover and the dog is cute, okay? Um, I definitely am one to judge books by the cover. Um, also, I got distracted when I was reading because I saw some uh, someone had found a Murakami novel that I've really been wanting. And I was like, oh, how did I not see that when I was looking through the used novels? Um, and I just kind of like kept my eye on her because she just kept on holding on to it while she was like looking for other options to add to her purchase or like swap out her books that she was holding in her hands. And I was like, please put, put back the Murakami and she didn't. So. I'm gonna have to look for more caught me in the future, um, but I'm enjoying my day so far. And Pocky, Pocky's making lots of friends. It's very popular here. Everyone, everyone always thinks that she's the fox. But anyways, having a good time so far. We move on to um, everything is illuminated, and um, yeah, enjoy this for as long as I can, and then head on home. She really does. She's a uh, Shiba mini Aussie mix. Yeah. Yeah. She's very shy, but you can trust. Here. I just got done eating steak, so you'll probably like me. Try that, and you'll probably smell it today. <laughs> ah, sweetie. Oh, oh, she's so soft. <laughs> How are you doing? Yeah. I'm gonna stay on the couch. Oh, Jesus. How old is she? Three years old now. Three. Yeah, did Mama get you a latte? A little puppy yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my
Okay, I would say that was a very successful day out at Mickey's. And um, that second book that I read, uh, Everything is Illuminated, it is, so far, I read the first 100 pages, just like I read the last book. It's about like great, 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 great grandchild trying to find out about, we're jumping between storylines. We're jumping like the timeline between a great, 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 so a lot of, I can't remember, a lot of great grandpa and grandchild like jumping between like 1800s to the 1900s. We're kind of jumping all over the place. So definitely like a very fluid storyline, but so far it's really good. So yeah, I can't wait to continue reading those books. So what a success picking two random but pretty. That was my only real barometer was like pretty books and based on the pretty books, which stories did I feel like I would vibe with and definitely vibe with those two. But yeah, so I really enjoyed my time and I hope that you did too. I'm gonna walk back home and I'm just glad that we were able to hang out together. I hope that you enjoyed the cozy and caring vibes and I hope you're able to share cozy and caring vibes with others. I love you all so much, bye. <laughs> so